Welcome back to Blockchain Pill, my name is Alex and today we'll have a look at one of the most popular dApps on the Internet Computer Protocol. OpenChat is a Web3 community building platform with many features that I haven't seen anywhere else. But before we look at those features, let's have a look at the project itself and at the tokenomics. First of all, OpenChat is a DAO, a decentralized autonomous organization, and it launched its token through the Internet Computer SNS Launchpad. Being a DAO means that the community decides what happens with the dApp and what Updates are pushed, which means that the team does not have absolute control over it. OpenChat raised 1 million ICP during the decentralization swap in exchange for 25% of the token supply, which were 25 million chat tokens at the time. The 1 million ICP are held in the DAO's treasury and can only be accessed by submitting a proposal if and only if the community decides to pass it. The current price per token is just over 20 cents and the market cap is around $10 million according to ICP. CPCoins.com. To connect to OpenChat, you will need an internet identity. I assume that most of you have an internet identity if you're watching this video, but for those of you who are new to the Internet Computer Protocol, go to the first link in the description below and you will be able to create an internet identity there. As soon as you start the app, you will pick your username and your display name. There are a lot of customizations that you can do to your OpenChat experience in your profile settings. Every OpenChat account comes with its own wallet in which you can deposit ICP, CKBTC, chat, or any other SNS token, and very soon you will find out why those wallets will come in very handy. You also have the option to become a Diamond member to access extra benefits like creating public groups, creating NFT-gated communities, to become eligible for airdrops, to earn referral rewards, and also to have a cool diamond badge next to your name. Currently, a one-year plan costs 1.5 ICP, which is around $6 at the current ICP price. So it's really not that expensive. This price is per year. So let's have a look at some of the features that OpenChat offers to its users. First up, OpenChat isn't just a one-on-one -on -one conversations app. It's about connecting with like-minded people and building communities. You can easily find communities that speak to your interests or create one of your own. With a robust system of roles, permissions, and channels, you are in complete control. Secondly, OpenChat was designed with mobile users in mind. The user interface seamlessly adapts to devices of all sizes, from mobile to desktop. Your experience remains top-notch no matter where you are. And while there is not a native app for OpenChat just yet, you can save the website on your phone and it's almost like an app. And one unique functionality of OpenChat is that it allows users to create proposals for any SNS project on the internet computer protocol which would otherwise require some coding knowledge okay so let's go ahead and create a group and see what cool things we can do in there so first off obviously we can send messages we can record and send voice messages which is pretty cool we can add emojis straight from the app which is great for when you're using the desktop version you can attach photos or videos to your messages and there is also an option to attach GIFs or create memes directly through OpenChat by using MemeFighter, an app developed by an ICP community member named Jesse, who many of you know as one of the hosts of the Neurotic Podcast. On top of that, you can create polls and those come with a whole bunch of options as well. And now this is where things get wild. Since every account comes with an integrated wallet, you can send cryptocurrencies directly to users in your group just by typing the user's name. Now, how cool is that? And finally, you can create prizes where you select an amount of ICP that you add into a pool and up to 100 users can claim a portion of it. And this also comes with different customizations. So let's create one right now. I'll leave the link to join the official Blockchain Pill Open Chat group in the description below. And the first 100 people who join this group will be able to claim some of this ICP. If you wanna edit your group, in the Edit Group tab, you can customize your group's name, picture, and description, and choose to make it a private or public group. And on top of that, any group can be NFT gated, meaning users can only join the group if they hold a certain NFT. This can be pretty cool for NFT projects that wanna have a holders only chat. This helps with that as well. In the edit group tab, you can also manage users permissions. To join new groups, you need to go to the explore group tab where you have the option to preview or join any available group. So let's join a few. Notice that there is already a lot of ICP groups on OpenChat. Like any other Web3 app, there is a referral program 
you can earn rewards for each user you refer that goes on to become a Diamond member themselves. I will leave a referral link in the description below and you can join OpenChat through my referral link if you don't mind me getting 50% of your fee. Keep in mind that you will not pay anything extra. In the future, the team will integrate voice and video calls, develop a native app, add end-to-end -end encryption and many other features presented in their roadmap, which I'll add in the description below. All in all, I think OpenChat is a pretty cool dApp. My favorite feature is that every account comes with an integrated wallet, which allows allows sending and receiving payments seamlessly without the need to give your wallet address to anyone. And on top of that, the fact that the community decides the future of the dApp and gets to vote on every update that happens, I think that is also pretty cool and pretty unique in the crypto space. Let me know in the comment section below if I missed any cool feature. And if you guys enjoyed this video, I'll go ahead and invite the OpenChat founders to a podcast so that we can learn more about what they're working on and the team itself. And with that, we're done. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.